So this is our entertainment room, which is deliberately sort of dark and kind of cozy too. It's actually got a massive, massive freaking dark mirror there with a backlight around it. In fact, that is a Philips Hue light strip with lots of extensions all the way around it so that we can then change the color and do things like that. And every now and then you'll make it like blue or pink or something and the kids will think it's hilarious. Now, as part of this room being a very kind of dark environment, so it's got a lot of dark wallpaper, things like that. Behind me is a massive flat screen TV, which is probably even pretty hard to see in this video because it is against a dark background. Now, Logitech Harmony Elite Remote. Incidentally, there is a Harmony integration into Home Assistant, which we're not even gonna need for this because what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go, hey, let's watch some Apple TV. That will then orchestrate the TV and the right inputs and the receiver and the right inputs. And if everything works right, the TV will come on. And then what I wanna do is I wanna put a nice backlight around that TV. So there's a Philips Hue light strip run around the back, which then lights up like that. Now, how does it light up like that? The TV is plugged into a TP-Link HS110 smart PowerPoint socket plug, you know, the thing you put the TV plug into it. And then when it sees power usage go up, it goes, okay, fine, now that's gonna trigger an event which will then turn on the Philips Hue that's around the TV. Both that Philips Hue and the one on my big freaking mirror just there are connected directly to the Philips Hue hub. They're not part of the Zigbee network that all the other bits and pieces like the Acara bits are on because I still wanted to have the native app to be able to control it. It's just much more intuitive, particularly for my partner and the kids and so on. Now, once we turn the TV off, the TP-Link HS110 is gonna see the power drop and it can then go and turn the Philips Hue back off. And I can also trigger that Philips Hue to turn off if I turn off all the other lights into night mode or something like that. So, Philips Hue triggered by power usage on the TV to put a nice little backlit glow around it. There you go.